Welcome to the Forator, and I'm Barry Abrams. The latest twist in the Maryland racing plot might be the winner. The Daily Racing Forum reports first racing, the nom de course for the Stronach Group, which owns all racing in Maryland, would deed Pimlico to the state, effectively placing the operation of the track in the hands of a not-for-profit group, which would be created to operate the track. Through that nonprofit group, the state would spend four years' worth of money to rebuild Pimlico with bonds that were passed way back. In addition to operating Pimlico, the new not-for-profit entity would also operate the Preakness Stakes. The Stronach Group would license that right to the not-for-profit entity. It appears the Stronach Group slowly applying the brakes to their presence in the state overall, which ramped up back in 2011. The Preakness would move to Laurel for the next two years, but when Pimlico's finished, Laurel will be torn down for other development. How successful will Maryland be when all the smoke clears? Have a good day, everybody. We'll see you tomorrow.